Yo, 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 guys, it's your boy iProMagix here today, and today we are delivering, uh, well, collecting a load from Oberhirschen, I think it's called, or Oberhirsch, whatever you would want to call it. We're somewhere in the um, <clears throat> northern part of Sweden, heading down towards Rotterdam. So now we're going to be heading down towards Rotterdam, heading home for the maiden voyage when we set foot back in the UK. So, after this, we are hoping to be back in the UK tomorrow, which will be quite nice for a change. Then, uh, after tomorrow, we have a 36 hours, which I've already done, and I am on the load that you'll be seeing two days from now. So, the load you'll be seeing after this will be a load heading from Grimsby, heading down towards Birmingham. Then we do a solo run back, which I don't show you guys. And here, I manage to clip the garage as I come in and dis damage the trailer a little bit. I could have uh, a war, like, made myself a bit of a, more aware of that, but unfortunately I didn't. So, hey, what can we do? So as I was saying, I, uh, sing right, I come down just from Birmingham now. Then I am heading back up to Grimsby as we speak. I'm on my 45 minute lunch break, uh, well, lunch break, hoping to get this edited whilst uh, cooking some food for myself. So, yeah, we are hoping to be back within a day. So, when you see episode 60, we should just be entering Birmingham. But when you see 61, you will see me in Grimsby. Picking up a load, heading down to uh, wherever we end up. Because I don't even know where we end up at this point. So, here, this particular road really confused me. Because they started driving on the hard shoulder. And I was like, hey, hang on, you can't do that. that That's against the law. How you do this? So, uh, I just stuck by the rules that I knew. Stay on the road, don't hit nothing. And keep everyone smiling. So, that's what we ended up doing. And uh, we got there very safely. Uh, there was a bit of a close call there. I nearly did clip that car. But luckily he was doing quite a fast speed to just miss me. And uh, I'm, I do find out in the end that uh, he does catch me on the train when we go to uh, over to Grimsby. And uh, not train the boat and we talk a bit. So Apart from that we are hoping to head back within the next couple of days to a different yard um, just a little bit of a heads up on the next load that we do from Grimsby to Birmingham it's to Triet so we've got a lot of different things hoping to happen for us in the next few well in the future I suppose and um, we are planning a lot more and uh, I'm hoping to stay in the UK for a little longer, even heading over to Ireland and places like that would be brilliant, but we have to see what the planners say. I can't forcibly go, I'm going here, but hey, but as I say, we'll see what happens and uh, we'll find out very, very shortly where we're going to be heading off to. So apart from that, we are nearing the end of this delivery, which come up very, very quickly, to be honest. And uh, I really, really enjoyed this run. It's something different. Like, you know, when you do a journey out, it feels like you're going to be out forever. But when you start making your way back, it just goes really, really quick. And I really enjoyed heading back because it only seemed like I was doing this load for maybe 20 minutes. But it turns out I was doing it for about four hours. But hey, so guys, I'm going to end it off here. So uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Guys, just before we end the video, I want to say a massive thank you for non-copyright sounds for letting me use Let Me In as the background tunes.